morning YouTube. I'm somewhere in South Georgia. I'm about a hundred miles north of the Florida line. It got too dark last night. I couldn't see anything so we had to stop and take a rest. But um, I'm gonna do my Music City Pipe Show and Sale Top 10. Maybe 11 or 12. We'll see. But uh, I got a new pipe. It's not a briar pipe, but it's uh, comparable to anybody that smokes cigarettes between pipes. Uh, I replace cigarettes with vaping, so I still smoke pipes. In case you were going to sit here and try to argue with me how shitty it is. Alright, so uh, number one, first thing I learned in Nashville at the uh, pipe show sale is that Boontar's hair is softer than mine and Skipsy's put together. I don't know what he uses, but mine is just oil. <laughs> um, second, uh, Nate the Great. Uh, I got to meet him and his wife, Rachel. Rachel, your name should be Rachel the Awesome because you are a pretty awesome lady and she made uh, some really incredible pipe bags. I highly suggest everybody pick one up. My dad got a pirate one for his church warden and I got a Star Wars bag. <clears throat> Sorry. Um, third thing I learned is that A.J. Brockman's uh, service dog, Dre, can do anything, even smoke a pipe. And that was pretty epic. Um, fourth thing, Brian, Beans316. Sorry, Joe, you are no longer the tallest uh, pipe presenter in YouTube. Uh, Brian took that from you. He's six foot six, but I swear when you're five foot seven, he looks like he's seven foot nine. But uh, awesome dude, really, really happy to meet him. You know, been watching all his videos for years. Uh, really good dude. Let's see, uh, Scooter. Fifth thing I learned about Scooter is uh, he is Josh is the jumpiest dude I know. Um, Literally, the wind could blow wrong, and he will jump. Um, I hope you resolve that and get better, buddy. Sixth thing I learned is that the semis should drive slower so they don't wreck the video. All right, sixth thing I learned is that Tom, Wisconsin Tom, diabetic man, makes the best homemade mixture snuff there is. He made a uh, Franken snuff, took all the crap that he didn't like, threw it in a pan, covered it up with a little menthol, and it was really good. The, it was the second best snuff I'd just say I've had. Uh, it was definitely the second I had that week, and the first was uh, Clover that uh, we got from Boontar. It is a what was it, American made, but it was a, a Kentucky blend, Dark Horse, uh, best snuff I've ever had, I mean, it just, it does everything you want, but, uh, let's see, where am I at, number seven, um, I already knew this, but it was confirmed, uh, Burley Man 40 and Kurt Keener, uh, David and Kirk are just as awesome in person as they are in video. They're, they're two great people to watch on YouTube and uh, very enjoyable to hang out and talk to. Let's see. Number eight, Mel. Mel does not look her age. <laughs> she looks a lot younger than she says she is. I think she's lying. And she is a very, very awesome person. Uh, let's see. The ninth thing I learned is that Amber does not yell at Mark. She talks loud to him. And I did not know this, but Mark is deaf in one ear. So, I always thought she was yelling at Mark. But, 
it's a loving it's a loving uh, talk loud anyways but those two um, yeah Boontar said it best best couple on YouTube uh, epic let's see uh, I think I'm gonna have I'm gonna have top 12 because I got 10 and I got some other shit I wrote down top 10 let's see uh, number 10 Joel Washburn uh, awesome to finally meet him and watching his videos for years uh, come to find out we have a good taste in uh, shoes <laughs> he knows what I'm talking about um, let's see that'd be number let's see number 11 I'm in Georgia there's nothing but weirdos down here crackheads and whores and there's a ghetto fight going on behind me Oh no, you didn't! Hear it? You're wrecking my video, lady. Alright, so uh, number 10 would, or 11 would be uh, TPC Mike. Knows how to bring the shine to the party, I'm just gonna say that. Uh, let's see, I guess I'm on number 12. Number 12, save for last, uh, the guys at Big Star Cigar and uh, Southern Fight Pipe Club, Chris Merkel. Joe Case uh, really put on an epic weekend. The meetup was everything expected and ten times more. Uh, Big Star's atmosphere was just a relaxed, hey, do whatever you want, have fun and party. And I like that. And it was my favorite. It was my favorite part of the weekend, getting to meet everybody. And it's a shame. I wish it was longer because there's some a lot of people I didn't get to meet. And, um, we gotta fix that. So, other than that, uh, one other thing Big Star Cigar has got something. <laughs> and, um, I'll, I'll share that on the, on the video when we finally get home. Me and my dad will do a video. And, uh, they got something that's really big there. So, I'll let everybody know if you don't know. A lot of people already know, but. Alright, that's my top 12, sorry I didn't do 10 like everybody else, but those were the things that I woke up a little bit ago and boom, it just popped in my head. Plus, I was thinking about them on the 400 plus miles we covered yesterday. There's really nothing you can do but look for cars pulling out in front of you and think about all the memories through the weekend, but uh, I had a lot of thinking to go yesterday, so had a smile on my face for 400 miles. See you, YouTube.